exhibition Nature Scape, which will be on at the Hughes Gallery from the 1st until the 27th of August. Um, it'll be open seven days a week and from 10 to 4 on weekdays and 11 to 4 um, during the weekends. Um, it's mainly of ceramic stacks and the photographs are being taken by James Field who's a professional photographer and, and they've been, uh, they'll also be for sale um, during the exhibition. Perhaps um, I might tell you a little bit about how they've been constructed. People have asked me whether they will fit for outdoors and um, I, I think they'll be quite sturdy. These particular ones um, are ceramic up the top and they've got a hardwood base. This is a jarrah base down, down the bottom. It's been sealed with Cabo's uh, natural decking oil to give that lovely um, red colour. Uh, it doesn't need to be maintained, but to keep that, that red, red colour, it will need a little bit of maintenance of um, a re repaint of the, the Cabo's oil on there. Uh, if it doesn't have the paint, then it, it will just age naturally over time and go a little bit greyish. Um, they're on a, a heavy metal base. The um, ceramic pieces is uh, threaded onto an aluminium uh, pole, and so that, there'll be no issues of rust there. Um, on, the other, on the other hand, these over here uh, on um, reclaimed sleepers, uh, they were from an old jetty. They're as hard as hard this this timber. They look they look fragile, but they're really tough stuff. Um, and brought back with a high pressure water hose, so um, they'll be um, equally at home in inside or, or outside. This is my four million bush. Um, it was all the a happy experiment really with uh, dealing with clay in different ways. The, the bottom piece is depicts the, the bracket fungus with the moonlight uh, shining on the, the fungus at night. Um, here we have the, the different phases of the moon, the dark, dark sky. Here I've played with um, oxides which have been rubbed back depicting a, a cloudy sky and then the full moon shining on the eucalyptus leaves. Um, the moon is done with crystalline glaze, which was always a bit tricky to do in my, my old kiln, but that was, that was quite successful. It, um, the crystals are created when the, when the cooling of the glaze occurs over a long period of time, so you have to keep the the glaze at a, um, a temperature range of 100 degrees, around 1100 degrees for a, a few hours. So I was quite happy with how the, the craters in the moon came out there. I was part of the Sala Festival in 2021. That was my first solo exhibition. And I was lucky enough to be the Active Aging Award winner, uh, which was sponsored by the Unley Council. My husband and I will be here on the weekends while the exhibition is open and I really hope you can come along and see and see my work. Thank you and thanks to the council for giving me this opportunity.